Hey, what's up everybody? Craylin here. I hope you all enjoy my third and fourth solo win in Call of Duty Black Ops Blackout Battle Royale. Now folks, I'm going to tell you this all. The camping in Blackout is real. Now when it comes down to the second and last and the last circle, I thought in Fortnite I camped. That's how I got the nickname Camper Craylin. Well, when you come out of the storm in the second to last and the last circle, and you think no one's behind you, you are getting shot in the ass by people still in the storm. I'm going to tell you, people camp this game more than any game I've ever played in my 50 years of playing games. Well, did I play games when I was a bad one? Either way, you know what I'm saying. All right, everybody, hope you all enjoy this. And Colin and I will be getting back to streaming Fortnite again. That's my son, Colin from Collins Club. We just needed a little bit of a break, and this game is an awesome break. If you didn't get it, run out there and get it, because Blackout is awesome. See ya. Hey, what's up, everybody? I'm going to give this a shot and narrate this. Let me know in the comments section what you think, what you'd like to see me do or try in the future. But uh, this is going to be my third solo win right here. Fourth one will be right after this. Now, I'm dropping down, and this is going to be a reason why you don't leave a game when you think it's over in the beginning. Now, I can't find a weapon, and I'm going to take some damage here. And I'm about to exit out because I take some shots in the backside. But it's a good thing I didn't because you'll see why at the end of the match. Now I get some stuff. I'm still looking for a weapon. Now I knew he had one. I'm trying to run away. Oof. It gets me in the back. I'm like, okay, I'm jumping to my death. But then I land right here and take some damage. Jump again. I'm like, you know what? Let me pull out my wingsuit. Jump down. Glide. And st I'm still contemplating. Do I leave? Do I stay? Take a little bit of uh, trauma kit meds right there. Get a little bit of health back. I'm like, I'm still thinking. Maybe I'll get up here and leave if there's not a weapon. I'm going to keep jumping forward too in all the videos I post so that way they're not really long because I don't get a lot of kills and, and I don't mind that I don't. I don't mind camping, you know, camper cradling from the Fortnite days. And now there's a guy inside that construction office. Now I did construction a lot over my years as growing up as a kid and the only time you went in there was when you were in trouble. <laughs> so he's up in there but then he jumps down and... <laughs> See you later mister or miss, whoever. You can't assume gender nowadays. So I'm glad that I stayed in the game. Now I'm gonna leave the construction site. And like I said, I'm gonna keep jumping forward so you don't see me camping a lot, because that would be a very boring video. I always check my map and where I'm at and where the uh, storm is. Now the construction site's behind me, I'll show you that, yep. The gas station's right here, I'm gonna scan that. And then I'm gonna move up the hill slowly to my left, but always carefully. Now the low crawling right here in this game is awesome. You're low crawling in the grass. I did a lot of low crawling when I was in the military, a lot. Make sure my weapons are loaded and ready to go because at the end of the circle, this is where the camping is at its best. Everybody camps the last two circles hard core, let me tell you. So here we go. I got one kill, there's three people left and it's just, you got to sneak around folks it's it's that crazy of a game you'll see if you haven't tried it you got to try it it's a blast and you know some people get triggered because you can't but really at the end that's all there is to do all right i'm looking for somebody i'm looking i'm looking i'm looking all right i see somebody so i pull out my weapon with a bit better scope a 7.62 right let's go on the uh, rounds and oh buddy see you later Say yeah, I wouldn't want to be a uh, <laughs> reload, load everything up, check it out. Now this next guy, I don't know why he does this. I'm still laying here and he goes over to the guy's stuff and it looks like he wants to go through his duffel bag to, to grab safety. some of his stuff, which it's the end of the game. If you don't have what you need at the end, it's a wrap because there you go, right? If you don't have what you need by the end, boom, see you later. Now here comes solo win number four for me which i got the next morning i think or night so i finally got the ranger character from the game you just watched to this game i grinded it out it's uh level 20 and it took a while now you can get it fast if you get a lot of kills because you get 10 points for each kill um and then like 100 and something for wins so here i run in get some ammo you're gonna see me camping a little bit more in this one like i said this game Camping is at its highest and I don't feel so bad camping in this game because like in Fortnite if you camp That means you're not a good builder and I'm not a good builder. So I have to camp this game here You know, like I said the campers are in high high amounts in this game 
I didn't have to camp that way. It was just bad luck on his part. Now, see, he dropped that duffel bag. I'll show you. I'm not going to go get it because a lot of times when people hear a kill, they wait for people to run up and try and get the duffel bag. Now, that's a med kit. Just like putting bandages on in Fortnite, people thought that that was going to be a bad thing. But you see how fast those, the bandages, the first aid bandages, actually give you 25 health each time. And you can carry 10 of them or and 10 in another slot. Let's see this. I'll show you after I... Ah, look at that. Whoa! How about that camouflage, buddy? Now, see, he just dropped that bag. See that bag that's kind of outlined in white right there? It's his duffel bag, and inside that is all the stuff that he looted and collected while he was playing. Now, I'll go out there. You can go through their duffel bag. Now, if you have a backpack, you can carry five things, like grenades, um, five perks. But if you get a backpack, which that's a duffel bag, you can carry 10 it gives you five more slots so you'll see i'll show you in a second so i'm picking up everything that he had and i think he has a backpack in here that i grabbed too see that's it yeah keep it yep there's a backpack right there see that so i grabbed that now i just gained five more slots so i can carry five more things there you go now i'm switching some weapons up here and i'm going to move on this game is really awesome i like this rampart 7.62 and i like the swordfish the swordfish, I think, is a four-round burst or a burst weapon. And I don't try and go too crazy with the scopes because I try and keep definitely a two-time scope, but at the most, a four. If you get, of course, if you get a sniper rifle, you have to find a sniper scope. But everything here is very military, very very much like Fortnite. Just take out the building and you do, you die a lot faster in this game. You, know, you, don't, you, know, you don't rush people as much. Now, I like to go around, I like to flank, like we called it when I was in the army. Yes, I was an army and free grunt soldier. So I like to flank things. I'm gonna go around up to this little section over here and I'm gonna loot up and see if there's some better, maybe a better weapon, maybe some more ammo, uh, maybe some more perks. You get these these little perks that, you know, if you, if you apply them, you get them for like two minutes, you can move. See, there's a backpack, there's some ammo. There's the level one armor. I think I already got level two on. I don't even think I had armor, no, I didn't. Now here's the storm. Now the thing about the storm is, just like Fortnite, you can stay in the storm and take damage. And that's what I'm going to do here. And I fast forward a little bit here as I loot this up. But uh, I didn't mind staying in the storm because it was the beginning of the game and I wouldn't have took a lot of damage. So you're going to see me heal up as I'm running. And I'm going to run and keep going and then I find a four-wheeler. I'll jump on the four-wheeler and get out of the storm even quicker. They put four-wheelers and trucks um, in various locations on the map. I feel like they do need a little bit more, but remember, this is the first week or two of the game, so there's gonna be a lot of uh, updates you're gonna see, because think about when Fortnite first started. Great game, just started, and you know, people, trial and error stuff, people uh, write in on Twitter or, Twitter or their pages, and then they take they take that advice. See, so I'm gonna, I'm gonna heal up a little bit more, I'm gonna get off. Now, you know, I'm in the open a lot in this game, but I don't mind, because this map, I think the map is a little bit bigger than Fortnite. And there's 25 people left, and it's very weird too when there's people left. There's people left longer in this game. Like when you get down to like the last 10 people, it feels like the last 10 people are alive for like a half an hour, it's crazy. Now, the driving on the trucks and the vehicles, you gotta push up on the left stick, and steer with the right. I don't mind that at all. I'm gonna take some fire here, watch this. Here we go, hold on a second. So somebody's firing at me from behind, so of course me being an infantry soldier, I'm going to take cover, I go through the corn, and then I'm going to go into this house here. But the driving the vehicles, I don't really mind that it's the left and right thumbsticks, because guess what? They're just to get you into the into the safe zone. They're not really made to be a big game changer. Uh-oh. See, I can break my window in my house, but somebody else can't. And this is why he shouldn't have broke my window. I get very upset right here. I'm going to show, I'm going to tell him. <laughs> Listen, it's just like people talking. You could talk about your own family, but your friends can't, okay? I can break my own window, but you can't. <laughs> so I'm going through his duffel bag. I'm, I collect as much ammo as I can and everything. Why not? So after I collect some ammo, like I said, I keep jumping ahead in the videos. And again, let me know in the comment sections if you like that I narrate these, because I'm going to start doing that in the future. Um, because a lot of people ask me in Fortnite, hey, you know, I know you're a camper and all that. I don't have a win yet. I watch your videos. Thank you. Since I've watched your videos, I've actually gotten my first win because I camped like you did. And uh, But this game, again, you have to. I'm going to be quiet because you're going to hear somebody in a second. See how I'm kneeling down walking? I'm doing the duck walk. All right, here we go. Shh. See, 
that? I hear somebody over there, but I don't know where they are. Also in the comment section, let me know, do you like that I have the music on low in the background um, along with the narrating, or would you rather just have me not do anything and show the actual gameplay or the whole match? Because if I were to show the whole match, these matches last about, I would say these matches are a little bit longer than Fortnite. Fortnite, you can get a match in 16 to 20 minutes. These, it seems like 18 to 25. So if I put two of them together, you know, 10 minutes, 12 minutes ain't long. So I'm looking for the person I heard over here, but I have no clue where they are. See, and the graphics are the graphics are okay to me. Some people are like, oh, the graphics aren't that great. Well, the gameplay is incredible. So now I low crawl down to the water right here, right? Take me to the water. There you go. Now I'm gonna swim. But this guy must be a smoker, because watch when he comes up. Three seconds under the water. Listen to him. Ready? All right, maybe five. <laughs> I mean, it's like, buddy, are you serious? Three seconds underwater, maybe five, and he starts coughing and all this hacking and everything. I'm like, hey, dude, really? All right. <laughs> all right, so here we go. Now, no pun intended, I'm a sitting duck, <laughs> right? Now that red smoke over there is a supply drop. I really don't care, because look like I said, folks, when the last 10 people are in the match if you don't have what you need by then you might as well just you know jump off the highest bridge or something well i don't think you'd be able to because then your uh, your wingsuit will uh <laughs> will open up so here we go we're at rivertown and fracking towers and i'm looking around again i'm a sitting duck on that rock like a turtle in the sun right all right here we go this guy like i said he must have been a smoker listen <laughs> He sounds like a like a ninety year old man. Dude, you're underwater for like five seconds. Are you serious? <laughs> All right, here we go up onto the shore. I'm gonna low crawl like I did many, many times, days and nights in the army. I'm gonna look around. See, I got three kills. Two people left. This is where you get your bread and butter right here. Do you want Italian or do you want Wonder? Throw a little nade, a little distraction, jump up. I'm in the storm and start to give me damage fast. I see him. I see him. Ah. Immediate AAR. See ya. Wouldn't want to be it. All right, everybody. Well, that's how you do it if you want to be a camper. This is Kralin, one of three YouTube channels. Go in the description of the video down below, and there's links to our other two channels. Thank you.